zoo question for you. Can you think of an animal that's got four toes on the front foot and three toes on the back? Well, a mystery question. Four toes on the front, three on the back. It's a South American tapir, a very odd animal. In fact, it's one of the more primitive of the mammals. And people looking at it see that rather peculiar sort of snout and think it must be rather related to a pig. But apart from the fact that it eats rather like a pig and with something like the same appetite, it's not. It's more closely related to horses and rhinoceros. But it is a very interesting animal. In fact, if we look at that snout, you can see that it's really a sort of trunk. Being a South American animal, it lives in the jungle and it wanders through looking for interesting leaves to eat. And that snout is rather like a long finger that can smell. You can see it's sniffing at the bread here and when it decides it likes it, it uses that snout, like a trunk, to tuck the food into the mouth. And those very large, powerful teeth can munch up pretty tough vegetation. Here's another one here. He's going to eat my jersey if I don't give him some of this bread. The eyesight's not particularly good, but smell is wonderful. And the tapirs are very docile, as you can see, and they're easily hunted. They're hunted extensively, don't do that, for their, uh, their skin, which is used as leather. That's one way in which they're endangered, but more severe is the destruction of the forest. So zoos play a very important role in preserving this creature by getting it to breed. Unfortunately, it doesn't breed awfully well in captivity. So here at the Adelaide Zoo, something of a coup is this little character here. He's a baby tapir, and he's just been born here. It's a fairly unusual event. Like all tapirs, you can see it's got this beautiful camouflage, which is very effective, because as the sunlight comes through the jungle leaves, it's all dappled, and the patterns on the skin of the baby break it up and make it very hard to see, until it's old enough to look after itself. Well, back to the original question, the toes. If you look at the foot, you can see that the front foot has four toes, the back foot has three. Pretty unusual in hoofed animals, which normally have two toes or one. Thank you.